In this video, I would like to share something with you I discovered for myself and maybe it helps you too in your journey of creating art. For the past 15 years, I used Photoshop as my daily driver. I use it for all my professional work when it comes to photo editing, sketching and pixel illustration. Now, Photoshop is an awesome program and whatever your point of view is about Adobe, I think we can all agree that it is the king compared to other professional programs out there. And these days, Photoshop is miles ahead with all kind of AI tools that makes working in Photoshop even better and way much faster. The downside is that Photoshop is so huge and it's filled with all kinds of things I don't use while drawing. I feel the program is suffering in performance. And on top of that, I face silly bugs that drives me mad. Like zooming in and out issues that makes me to need to restart Photoshop entirely. It brought me to a point that I was looking outside the Photoshop scope and that is where I discovered Krita. The first time I fired up this program, it felt like I was coming home. I guess because it feels so close in Photoshop in the way the UI looks. I discovered that the brush engine gives you way much more config options and you can feel that the program is created for the illustrator. It are the simple things like fast flipping the canvas or adding composition lines with a mouse click. On top of that, Krita is open source and maybe the best part, it's completely free. So far, I think I'm addicted and I'm trying to give Krita a place in my workflow. Anyway, if you didn't try Krita before, give it a try. I will add the link down in the description. Well, that's it for this video. I hope it inspired you a little bit. And if you liked the video, share me a thumbs up. And if you're not subscribed yet, consider a sub and help me to grow this channel. Now go draw your own best drawing. Thank you for watching and take care. Roy out.